where are products like these being made? I'm your state capital reporter, Alana Johnson, and President-elect Donald Trump has proposed tariffs on goods coming inside the U.S. from other countries. So I talked to a Jackson County manufacturer about the impact that it will have on his business and what it would mean to have more products being made right here in our neighborhoods. Shane Grant makes products you don't even know you may need. A manufacturing facility that uh, uh, takes complicated uh, materials and turns it into um, components for other industries to be able to create their products. His company, Machining Momentum, works with companies here in Michigan and all over the country. Really proud feeling to be able to uh, say I'm a U.S. based manufacturing you know, a company that supports so many different industries a a across the nation. And Grant says being a U.S. based company may mean more if President elect Donald Trump imposes tariffs on products coming into the country. That way we can create a product within a, a price range that can be still profitable for everybody to grow their companies. The Michigan Manufacturing Association says bringing tariffs could mean more workers coming to our state. And what that means bringing it home, uh, that is over 600,000 Michiganders working directly in manufacturing. Uh, so that is a huge number of individuals creating uh, enormous, enormous wealth and opportunity. But he also says that introducing broad-based tariffs can cause problems for our world economy as well. Uh, we make things for the world, the world makes things for us. Uh, whether it's in the supply chain or for uh, consumers. Um, so there has to be some open uh, opportunities for businesses to import and export products. But for the U.S.-based business owners like Grant, it could lead to some big solutions. We're just excited to be in the country working for people in the United States and supporting that growth. In Jackson County, Alana Johnson, Fox 47 News.